Final preparations are underway for an annual celebration taking place this weekend. We're now just days away from Seattle Pride. King 5's Alex Rozier talked with Mayor Jenny Durkin, a member of the LGBT community, about what this weekend means to her. Alex, good morning. Joyce, good morning, especially as a member of the LGBT community. This weekend significant on many levels, but she's very proud of Seattle and its celebration of Pride, one of the largest in the entire country. Now grown, it's outgrown Capitol Hill. It's this huge event. It brings people from all over the region. It's really fun. I had the chance to sit down with the mayor. We talked about Seattle Pride. She says it really is an opportunity for the entire community to come together and celebrate the LGBT community, but she knows even though there's progress, some in the LGBT community are still hurting. I asked her this. To, to the young person, to the older person that may be struggling uh, with who they are, yep. what is your message to them? You know, I think the hardest thing sometimes is to, to come out. Um, it's that fear of not having acceptance, and I think that's one thing that Pride Week shows is there can be acceptance at every level and that you can be who you are, do the work you do, and still thrive and survive. And the mayor will be there this weekend to celebrate. Aside from the parade, there are plenty of other activities, things that start as tonight, actually, here on Capitol Hill. Let's come back out live, seeing one of the many pride flags here on the hill. They're going to be having Pride Fest taking place in Cal Anderson Park. And the parade, of course, going to be happening Sunday morning. A whole lot of fun happening the next few days. Stephen Joyce.